how to make a mason bee home. And mason bees are just are not honey bees. They're just bees that are, are native to America. And they are solitary bees. So they don't actually live in a hive like honey bees do. They just go around by themselves. And it's, uh, they're very good pollinators to have in your garden. So especially in the summer where most of the produce that you're growing is uh, pollinated by insects. It's good to attract those mason bees in. And to make a mason bee house, it's pretty easy. The only things you need, um, you need some 4x4 four four wood, preferably soft wood. I'm using Douglas fir. Uh, you need a saw to cut that wood. So you can see here, I've cut it in, this is a 10 inch piece, and it's a little bit slanted. So I'm going to put this, this uh, smaller, thinner piece of wood as a roof right on top, like that. Um, and then what I've made is a little guide out of cardboard. So I'm going to use my power drill with a 5 16 inch drill bit on it. And just going against, putting this against my, my, uh, my bee house, I guess, I'm going to drill holes every place where I put an intersection. And the way I made this, I just, uh, this is a, each square here is 7 8 inches wide and one inch tall. You can do it, so you can space it kind of however you want. Uh, this is just how I chose how to do it. Alright, so I'm going to get to drilling. And I'm going to go almost all the way in, um, leaving just about a half of an inch on the very back. So the bees are going to come into these holes, they're going to have, they're going to nest in here um, and then they're going to pick up any wet dirt that they find around so it's good to keep like a little pile of mud somewhere that they can pick up and they're going to seal off the holes with that mud. Um, so the last thing that we're going to do is put a roof on top of this because if it rains we don't want the rain to wash away the ceiling they put on here, we want the rain to just fall off. Okay. So I have my little uh, roof piece here. Just use a less than it's almost less than one inch piece and cut it down to the right size. And now I'm just gonna uh, just drive these screws in to fasten the roof on. Alright, so uh, that's it. Just about done, I'm, or pretty much done. I'm just going to mount this onto one of the walls here. And you want to mount it on the southern, uh, any southern facing wall because the, the bees do like that uh, warmth throughout the day.